I think one of the, the important things for me is, I mean, I, I think that actually what we're saying is that escalation, military escalation in Syria is not going to make the situation any better at all. I mean, the city, cities of Syria like Aleppo, Homs, parts of Damascus, Eastern Ghouta are rubble. Then they've been made rubble by Assad and Putin's government, actually, against their own civilians. And what we've done to support civilians in Syria to actually do something about the situation is absolutely relatively nothing for the last seven years. And now they decide that they're going to join Donald Trump in actually bombing and bombing installations. And it's not going to make We are a political protest band. We don't play that many gigs in venues. We prefer to play on the streets to the real people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was told by the mayor of criminal for me for Theresa May's government is. They talk all the time about the, the plight of Syrian civilians and other refugees from other war zones in the world, and they've never, they don't let very many refugees in, hardly any refugees compared to places like Germany and, and Holland and Sweden, where they've actually said to people, you're, you're fleeing war and deprivation and you can come to our country while the things, you know, until things improve or just stay, and then we haven't done that. I um, think the time that I have demonstrated against the bellicosity of our government supporting the Americans, and it is even even more important at the moment because Trump does not impress by his powers of intellect and I fear for the future of my grandchildren, uh, as well as his denying climate change and doing nothing about it, about bringing uh, executive powers to bear in actually uh, you know, denying things that are already on the statute book. And, and he just is a tub-thumping warmonger. And to actually and I... just do it because Donald Trump thinks it's a great idea and not do it without even going to Parliament. Doing it before Monday when Parliament comes back in is criminal. If, even if they, if, it doesn't matter whether the, the way the vote goes is, is, is probably they, they'd vote for war anyway. But the point is it would be discussed. It would be out in the open air. People could hear, hear the arguments. They could hear what their MPs are saying about it. And, also, the fact is that she's gone to war today, yesterday, this morning, whenever it was, with the, with the knowledge that 80 or over 80 percent of the British population do not support bombing Syria, and that's a fact. And I, I just think that you know, to do that, it's a minority government. The woman is just out of order, and she should not have done that.